Well, here we have a next wallet. I created a new one, put 100 uh, next in there. And I, I went through a lot of features really quick, the asset, marketplace, alias, messaging, a ton of stuff. Today, I just want to do a real quick video on the digital goods store or the marketplace. So here's the next wallet. So this is after we've logged in here. We have marketplace. So this is where I can uh, search for goods and see what goods I've purchased. And then we have a my store. So if we actually want to list goods for sale, we can do it in this section here. Now, one of the things um, that is true for both the asset exchange and the marketplace is that if you want to buy something, you have to know the exact account ID. You'll notice that this does not allow you to search for like shoes in here. This is not where you put in shoes or whatever you want to put in. This is where you put in a specific uh, NXT account ID that is selling goods. Now, that's a, a protective feature because um, right now anyone can come up with any name they want. So um, the, the decision was made that they don't want you to be able to search directly from the wallet um, until some, some good kind of reputation systems are put in place. So currently, if you want to go and purchase something from the next ecosystem or the marketplace, you have to use a third-party website that is um, that lets, lets you browse that. So this is one of the, the uh, one of the good ones, nxtblocks.info, and we can go to the digital marketplace. So I like this one because it shows, um, you know, it has a little, actually a built-in web wallet, market overview, asset exchange, and the digital marketplace. Now you notice it has this disclaimer, NXT Blocks does not endorse any of these goods. So the, the listing is not really on this website, the listing is in the NXT blockchain, which is and distributed around a peer-to-peer -peer market or you know peer-to-peer -peer network across the world. So let's if we go down, let's see uh, what what's in the marketplace. Here's a someone that just wants a tip, so you could send this guy tips if you feel real generous. Uh, we've got all kinds of links. We've got uh, lots of domain names for sale, uh, Groupon for sale, Scrap Gold. I don't know if I'd sell Scrap Gold uh, on the NXG exchange, but the, the main use case is for digital assets. You'll notice that this guy's talking about a physical asset, but the main, you know, that's why we call it the DGS, the digital goods store. Um, because not when you do the transaction, the seller can send you uh, can send you a digital good encrypted directly through the NXT blockchain. So let's scroll down here and see if there's anything that we could potentially all right, so I saw one that said wallpaper. Let's uh, let's do NXT wallpapers. Five NXT sixteen custom. Let's do the uh, custom wallpaper. So here's the seller. We'll copy and paste the seller um, ID here. I'll go back to our. NXT wallet, and we paste in our uh, the seller's ID here. So we search for this, we see that the same guy is doing. Uh, he's got he's selling four things here: he's selling you know, custom wallpaper, a limerick. He can also press, uh, he can uh, a game I made a while back. Okay, uh, so we should do custom wallpaper, a limerick. Um, Let's do, we'll do a custom wallpaper. So we'll click on it. And so it says custom NXT wallpaper, price 16 NXT. So you see a description. You can say how many you want of it. Uh, delivery deadline. So if they don't deliver within 48 hours, um, I get the money back. So if I hit add message, I can add a message to here. And I can, um, so I can say, I would like, um, I would like, crypto.com. Okay, so that's submitting, and there it is. So we've submitted an order. 
So now if we go to uh, purchase products, we see custom NXT wallpaper is listed as a purchase product, but this order status is tenanted. And so if we now go up to our dashboard, we see our balance has decreased um, by the amount in order to, to send the, the transaction. So we'll go back down to the marketplace and we'll go to um, my store. So my products for sale. So let's actually list a product and let's call uh, product a new product for sale. Let's say we want to um, custom message on next video podcast crypto.com a, a mention of your message will be on the next video for everyday crypto.com as part of a demonstration of the digital goods system. Not obscene based on my judgment. You know, these people go crazy. Who knows what they'll send me. All right, so I'll put a tag, an ad, or I'll just say it's an ad. Price of 10 NXT. Price of 1. And we'll paste our password in there for the wallet. All right. Incorrect tag link. No, oh, it has to be at least three characters. So, advertising. Did I even spell advertising wrong? Who knows? <laughs> He's submitting. This is exciting. We're listing this as my first product for sale on the digital goods market. All right. So my products for sale, my pending orders. So this is people who are trying to buy my product, my completed orders, list products for sale. Well, we already did that. Let's go back up to my products for sale. So custom message on next video podcast. It's readycrypto.com, quantity one. So I could change. So the actions I could do is I could change the price, change quantity, and delete. Now, if we go back to a dashboard, that transaction hasn't been confirmed yet. Um, see, it's in italics here. I believe once it goes out of italics, it's, it will be confirmed. Unconfirmed yet. I'll go back to the marketplace um, and see purchase products. My order is still pending. Go back to my store, my products for sale. Okay, so now... I can hit the button. So my uh, my transaction has been confirmed confirmed on the blockchain, and I can change the price, change the quantity, or I can remove the listing. So um, so that's it. We'll probably take a break now and come back in a little bit and see if we can find anyone. Hopefully, someone will, will buy this so I can complete the video, and uh, hopefully, this uh, order will get completed. But we'll uh, we'll see in a couple days if. All right, so it's been a day since we put the um, uh, since we created the listing on the marketplace. So I'm gonna go to my store and go to my pending. Oh, first my products for sale. So it's still listed for sale, but actually the quantity has now, has now dropped to zero. The listing is completely. Uh, yes, the listing is still there, but the quantity is zero. So now if we go to my pending orders. This is someone actually ordered. So someone gave me 10 uh, next in order to display a message on next video podcast, custom message on next video. So now I have the opportunity to deliver the goods. So first, the buyer was able to send me a note. And that note was encrypted. And it's encrypted with my passphrase. So I have to put in my passphrase to decrypt the message from the buyer. So I hit decrypt, it says wallet.mynext.info will be releasing a new Android app in the next days. First next Android online next wallet. That's awesome. So that's, uh, let's uh, go to that website real quick. Uh, that's pretty cool. Uh, an, a wallet for NXT. So um, so here we go. So there's right now they have an online wall online wallet. Um, let's see if it says anything about Android here. So I don't see anything yet. 
but uh, we'll be releasing an Android app. So if you uh, if you're on the Android platform, look for mynxt.info or come back to this web page wallet.mynext.info. Uh, so that'll be pretty cool. Have a, a wallet on Android. That's pretty exciting. Um, uh, see, uh, I'll have to get an iPhone wallet as well. All right, so what I'm going to send now, I can, uh, the options that I have, so typically a digital good, some digital goods are small enough that I can put it directly in this data field. It is limited to around 1,000 bytes. Um, I think they're, I, I don't know if it's exactly 1,000 bytes, depending on, um, I, I think the whole message is maybe limited to 1,000 bytes, but the, the client will tell you if you're exceeding the limit. So some digital goods, depending on the size of it, you may be able to put in right here. So I'm just going to put, um, I, uh, the video will be posted at, I'm just going to put, uh, this is the URL that the video will be posted on. It's not posted yet because I'm actively making the video as I speak. So we'll put the, the video here um, in the next couple of hours. So now discount. So if the customer, if you gave someone a discount, they could just put that in their note to you and you can actually, I can add a discount. So I could discount the transaction by two next. So that means the customer would actually only, I'm refunding them essentially uh, two NXT. Um, we'll, we'll just do a discount of two um, just to, to show you how that that works and verify that I am telling you the accurate price. Um, here. And then again, we have to put in our passphrase so that our reply and can be encrypted and this is a new transaction that goes out onto the next um, uh, network. So now we're gonna hit um, deliver purchase. And also keep in mind that, um, I, I, it's kind of hidden here, but uh, the delivery deadline was on the 11th, so tomorrow sometime. Um, if I hadn't, you know, you can essentially cancel a uh, order just by not responding to it. Um, and, and then you can see the buyer's NXT address. In Next, you can also send a address, a um, uh, a, a message directly. So you can uh, send a message to a particular address. So if you had some kind of follow-up question or something that needed to be arranged or organized, you can coordinate with the buyer and come to an arrangement. So now it's not no longer in my pending orders, it has now moved into completed orders. So we have custom message on, so that's it. And um, it looks like, you know, even I can come back here and decrypt the transaction, and I can even later refund this purchase. So now let's go back to my dashboard, and you'll notice that, um, let's see, the, my balance has gone up by 8 next. So we, um, we've increased, actually I think uh, it's gone up, I received 8. I think to complete the transaction, I had to pay one next in transaction fees. Um, <clears throat> so that's what this, this fee here. So that's why I, I believe it was 82 and went up to 89. Uh, I can look back in the, and check that. But uh, you know, we did, you know, we, we received the next. Um, so now, and actually in the last video, I also made a purchase. So let's go purchase products. And uh, I made a purchase, and last time we left it, it was in status pending. So the seller has actually completed that order on their end. So I now have a custom NXT wallpaper, and um, the data was encrypted. So he, the way he sent it to me was he spent, sent me a private Dropbox link that now I can go into and pull up my customized uh, my customized NXT wallet here or customized NXT wallpaper so that's pretty cool so I, I forget how much I even paid for that but uh, 
You go look on here. Well, I, I paid I paid sixteen next for that. So I will uh, put that on there, and um, we'll see that. So that's uh, that's the NXT digital goods store. So you can buy and sell. Um, the, the main thing that's missing today is a reputation system. And again, I, I believe I, I talked about this a little bit in the first video, is that the way you have to actually make transactions, you have to put in the seller's um, next account address directly. Um, and that's mainly to protect the consumers. They have to go to an external site, find a specific buyer, and put it in directly. Um, again, that's there, there's scammers out there that want to post. They, they try and mimic, you know, legitimate entries to make it look le like a, someone you recognize. But they, so to avoid, you know, that trickery until the reputation system comes online, you can't look, you can't search directly in the the next wallet. Um, but again, you've got uh, NXT blocks info that uh, allows you to search um, search the digital marketplace. I believe I heard some guy has a listing that's available through Tor as well. Um, and that's it. So I hope you enjoyed the video. If you like this, give it a thumbs up and uh, subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. Thanks again.